for cheap, fast, and reliable coins. Make sure to head on over to my sponsor, buymadencoins.com. They got quick delivery, 24-7 support, and make sure to use code POOL at checkout for 20% off and an extra 10% coins at checkout. Hey, what is up, guys? It's Poodle back with another Mad Milton Team video. So today, I'm going to be showing you guys how to get a free 97 overall Nat Team MVP. It is Nat, but it doesn't mean it's not good because that is a 97 overall. And these Nat, these MVPs are pretty good. Great for any team. Also great for theme teams. They're not just exclusively to theme teams. And if you don't like, you can always re-roll it. Although, I don't recommend re-rolling it usually because you literally could lose all of those scouts. All the scouts you got off that re-roll, you could end up with nothing. End up with no player and waste your time. But... Besides the point, before I get into the video, first off, thank you guys for all the support. We were at 1,250 subscribers just about. That is insane. I mean, I could never have imagined being this many subs. I know it's not many for a lot of people, but for me, I couldn't imagine being here this soon considering I was at 300 last week. I, I at one point thought I was going to hit 1,000 by like July-ish, May-ish, June around there. But if you're watching this video, go sub to the channel. Show some love. We're doing amazing. We're doing amazing for ourselves. For me, I'm. I, I feel. I'm happy with how things are going. And whoever's watching this, just show some support. You won't regret it. And uh, also, I'm out to California in about two days, so I got to start pre-recording a lot of stuff. I'm a little behind. I have some collabs coming with some, some some with two guys. I hope so. I'm pretty sure two guys. And I'll probably be doing some like mud draft. Maybe that's what I'm thinking of for it. But I got to call Elgato first because for some reason my gameplay's pixelate. I don't understand why. Now, enough of that. Should be some good stuff next week and then some Cali footage. So besides that, so this this um, these house rules right here. These house rules give you the team MVP 97. Now, I did not mean to click into that. Now, this week's is take a chance and go for gold this week. All two-point conversions are now quadrupled in value. You'll earn eight points for making a successful play after touchdown. So all two-point conversions are now quadrupled. So you get eight points for a two-point conversion after touchdown. That's pretty wild, honestly. Two-point conversions are not hard. I mean, if you're playing a pretty good guy, it can be hard because it's easy to lock that up sometimes. But if you if you just run any of, like, the meta run plays, you know, like a stretch to the left with tight ends at wide receiver, like, you could easily pound that in. Not to mention everyone falls backwards now. They did just fall. So, like, you could probably just run that up the gut and get in there. This is probably going to be a very cheesy week now. So, it's looking like regular offense. Okay, so this is going to be a very... It's going to be regular this week. So, to win this... Nothing special on offense, right? Nothing special. Just play the game. Now, I would always go for the two-point conversion, personally. Because losing a point's not a big deal if you don't get it. It's really not that big of a deal. But if you get it, that's a whole other... That's like scoring two touchdowns in a row. So, I would be going for this every time, just about. Unless you really don't need it and you just need the, two, you just need the one to win. But I would be going for this. This is also kind of productive, right? Like, for some people, if you're if you're winning 7-7 seven, uh, seven and they score on you and they don't get it... Maybe you don't, maybe you just, you, you run the ball at the rest of the possession. You don't want to give, you might not want to give, this is a game mode where you want to be defensive, right? You don't want to give people the ball that often because literally one successful two-point conversion can change the game. So if I were you guys, I tried to like maybe chew clock a little bit in this. If you're, if you're good enough and you're overpowering the other person, I would just score and then try to chew as much clock as you can because truthfully, it could hurt you in the end, right? So let's say you score, you just get, you get a, you get a touchdown, you get six points, right? And then you missed a two-point conversion. Then you get another touchdown. You missed a two-point conversion. You're up 12 nothing. This kid gets a touchdown. He's not good at the game, but he gets a lucky breakaway touchdown. He gets a two-point conversion on you. Now he's beating you. He's beating you 14-12. Maybe you lose now. So you were dominating him, but just because you went for those two, so it's, it's all situational to the game, obviously. You have to really stay wary of what the other guy's doing because, again, these challenges are always risk-reward. And um, I would do them. I'd 100% do these this week. So... I'm probably going to be doing these because that is an awesome deal. An MVP pack and the and the coins and the trophies. I don't mind them that truthfully because if not, I mean, I'm hoping for an Ogletree or a Soldier to put them on my team. Maybe a Khalil Mack so maybe I can give away mine or sell my Khalil Mack. That'd be honestly cool. Maybe if I get Khalil Mack, I could sell off my Khalil Mack or I could give them away on um on Twitter. So that'd be pretty cool. Now, 40,000 40, coins. I mean, people don't look at those rewards, but truthfully, sometimes those rewards are the best. Like, I love series trophies because I, well, once you, once I finish my job Madden, I'll probably hate them. But for right now, if you guys just save up these series trophies, you could just toss them into the John Madden set and sell that guy for a quick 500k if he's still going for around there. I haven't checked in quite a while because I've never planned to sell mine. But series trophies are huge. The coins are huge. And in fact, this one is a must do this week. And it's not like anything really like stupid and cheesy, like where... You know, people are going to be playing really different. People are going to be playing pretty normal. The only difference is that they're going to not be taking the PAT, probably. That's the only difference in this challenge this week. Now, I can understand where you can get really pissed off where someone could score on you at the end and get that 8-point uh, conversion. And it could cause some issues. 
but I mean, wow, eight point conversion. That's, that still got me. That's crazy. I'd be pissed if someone got that on me and beat me. Now I'm gonna go see over. I'm gonna go look at what MVPs I kind of want here. So, hmm, if I get Khalil Mack, I might do a giveaway on Twitter and I toss you guys a uh, Khalil Mack. Comment down below if you guys like to see that. I'd like to see a giveaway. If I get the Khalil Mack, obviously, right? It's gonna be probably a low percentage of that. Also, um, I contacted the guys who won the 20k, so that's oh, that's good and over with. Uh, I got to do the one from yesterday now, which I will be drawing later in the Q&A probably. I'll probably mention that then. By the way, yeah, the Q&A is today, so that's pretty awesome. Uh, hopefully it goes well. First time ever doing Q&A in my life, so hopefully this goes cool. My girlfriend's, you know, she has to get ready and do her stuff. You know how they are. She'll be here at some point after school. She, I think she has out of class right now, and then she'll be heading over. Probably has to get ready. Anyways, so if I got one, I probably would want... Betonio, uh, Travis Kelsey, Elliot would be cool. Julio Jones, Soldier, Norwell, Taylor Morton, Alvin. Oh, I really want to try this Alvin Kamara out. There's a lot of these guys now. Damn. The, yeah, the odds of getting Mac are low, but if you guys want to see a Mac giveaway, comment down below. Maybe I'll be doing that if I can pull this Mac out of this. I might be, if I build the Giants team team, by the way, I might end up tossing some players up for giveaways. So. You know, if you're still in this video right now, I'm just letting you guys know that if I do the Giants team team, I'll probably get, give away some of the players on my team now and then try to uh, assemble the Giants team team with, I'll try to build it first. Whenever's left over coins, I'll try to give it away. Win a total of 10 times. Oh, you have to win a total of 10 times this week. All right. Still useful, but 10 times is a lot. It's kind of a drag. It's not bad though. So that's about it guys. So first off, before I get out of this video, stay tuned for the Q and A later. It's going to be really fun. I have a lot of questions picked out. You guys gave me some really good questions. So hopefully I can get that good. I gotta make the thumbnail for that. Um, trying to make that one really cool. Our video was actually ranked for the uh, Q&A thing yesterday, which is pretty cool. I didn't think a Q&A for my channel would rank, but that was pretty cool. And uh, yeah, so if you're watching, comment down below if you'd like to see a giveaway for Khalil Mack. Also, uh, what's it called? Leave a like. And um, if you have any last minute questions, any last minute questions for the Q&A, Drop that down below and I'll try to get to those because maybe I'll toss some bonus ones in from this video. There's still an opportunity. The video won't be done and filmed to about probably like five o'clock ish. So you still got time to drop a question on that. And as always, if you guys need any help, hit me up on Twitter. Any DMs, anything. My DMs are always open if you guys need any market help, any Madden help. I've been helping a lot of people out actually lately. Most of the same people, but some new, a lot of new faces lately as of uh, the channel growth. Gotten a lot of new faces. So that's about it, guys. Thank you so much for watching. And if you enjoyed, make sure to comment, like, and sub. I'm out. See you later. One well, last thing before I get out of this video, I'm just going to toss this into the video. This is being recorded after. I'm sorry. So the q and either going to be today or tomorrow. A little difficulty with having to get stuff ready for California. We're going to try to get it today. I didn't mean for that to be open. Now, um, sorry if it doesn't get up today, but I mean, if you guys, I mean, you guys have more time for questions. There's a good chance it'll be up today, but it might be tomorrow. Also, I have a sniping filter video pre-recorded. Comment down below if you guys want to see that today or should I save it for tomorrow or should I save it for the week when I'm gone? Um, I haven't really decided on what I want to do with that yet. I'm just saving it because I know I'm going to need a lot of videos. I only got like two gameplays ready for that week I'm gone that I'm going to try to do. And then I'm going to need some more footage. I'll be gone for like five to six days. So I want to get everything ready. So comment down below if you guys want to, you guys want to see, you guys have more questions on the Q&A. Comment down below if you guys need to, if you guys want to see the sniping filter today or tomorrow. I'll have it ready to be uploaded. I just don't know if you guys want it today or tomorrow. Should I save it for tomorrow? And, um, yeah, I mean, it's about it. I hopefully get everything in order today so that I can be ready to have to pre-record a lot tomorrow, like a lot. So hopefully I can get everything ready today. We just got to, you know, get the, the traveling essentials, maybe some clothes and some other stuff I probably don't really need to do, but we're going to do it anyway. So hopefully that's all good. And hopefully I schedule these right. Cause if I don't schedule these right. That would suck. Imagine I make all these videos and none of them go up and it's not like I could tell someone to do it for me. My family's got no idea what they got to do on here, but yeah. Hopefully, hopefully it all goes well and the sniping I'll probably give you guys about three sniping filters that week About three sniping filters, maybe two gameplays and maybe one one kind of coin method or some kind of market market talk So I hope to get down done that week. Hopefully it all goes as planned. I mean You know how things go, right? I think I just take their own course sometimes, but All right now. This is about it guys. So this should be the end of the video Sorry if, if you guys are still here. Thank you for listening and uh, yeah, go drop the sub Comment if you guys want the filter today, if you guys want it tomorrow, what videos you guys want to see while I'm gone, some Q&A questions, and uh, just what's up. Go follow me on Twitter. Go follow me on Twitch. I will be starting to Twitch again, and that's about it. Thank you very much, guys. Be sure to sub. I'm out. See you later.